I'm actually sapiosexual or am I just a hoe? Because <laughs> <laughs> why the what? fuck are you wet? Because they gave you whoa, money. Whoa. Yeah. It's been forever and a day. Okay. I'm so, so sorry. But the thing is, for every time that I go off and maybe I don't release an episode till like um, one month, two months, whenever I, co I come back, I come back with a bang. And you guys know, like, I always come back with a bang. Okay. <laughs> you are money. So, <laughs> <laughs> so um, welcome to yet another episode of Sex and Times with Maya. Happy New Year, my babies. I've missed y'all so much. So emotional, I'm touched. <laughs> yeah, so on this episode, I have with me the one and only Chris Queen, drama queen, everything queen. I deserve a round a of applause. A bad bitch, a bad, bad, bad bitch. And then again, I have with me Ajibadi. Ajibadi is a creative director. He is um everything creativity. So, um... The rule of Sex and Times with Maya now, this year, is like shots before we start every episode. Shots for the guest, except me. I don't know if we'll I'm see. excited we'll or see. scared. <laughs> mm, as we go on, we would know who would um, get drunk first. So, you guys, shorts, Let's shorts, go. Cheers to that. Cheers to Oprah. Ah, uh ah, -uh. ah, uh ah. -uh. I have drunk as <laughs> you. So I have a question for you. Uh, okay. um, let me start with you, baby girl. I okay. have a question for you. Yes. So have you ever had an office relationship before? Like all the places you've walked, have you ever had an office relationship? Um, okay, I've walked in plenty of places, first of all. Secondly, yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, it was never official. It was just more about Taparata and... What is that? No, see, see. <laughs> but the people that don't understand, you have to tell us what that means. Okay, taparata is more like. Is it like Brian's. Brian is. No, song? not tatatas. I mean, taparata is like. It's just like, don't speak. Just taste and go, taste and go yeah, to no. be sure you really want it, but you just never eventually enter the relationship. So okay. it's more like. Actually, touch and go. Sorry, was it sweet? <laughs> Was it? Was it <laughs> okay, so I don't feel I don't feel <laughs> all right talking about this because I mean no. I don't start this on the bad note, but may so rest in peace. Oh, yeah, so but then I worked at the place. I don't know if I'm snitching on myself too much. Um, I think I was 16 at that point, but it didn't work because he later found out I was 16. I was turning 17, and he was in his late 20s, so he oh. didn't feel good about it. Oh. So he never oh. developed into something serious. You know, ever since like 2020, 2019, when the whole rape thing, girl yeah. accusing guy thing happened, I feel like guys are extra careful. Yeah, yeah. yeah they yeah. are like extra careful. So you go to a guy's house and if you say no, um, you just lock up. You just lock before, up. Before before tomorrow, you see yourself on Insta blog. <laughs> you see them dragging your Insta blog. I you saw my pants and <laughs> flipped me over. Yeah. I mean, no bags, but how would they rape you with doggy? Like, are you for real? I mean, I'm not rape shaming anybody, but that table, that table is gonna be shattered. <laughs> Ajibadi yourself, have you had like an office fling or relationship before? Oh uh, yes, of course, I have. You know, uh, you know, say you know, I'll be Nigerians will say now what do you. You chop with, you know, <laughs> when you still chop and they sweet. <laughs> so here's the thing. Uh, okay. I can still like picture it clearly. So there are times you just want to concentrate. Okay. You have a very, you know, um, you have a brief in front of you and you just need to just break it down yeah. and get things done. Yeah. And then, uh, and then we just pass. You know, it was fun, trust me, it was, it was fun, fun yeah. because again, there's no, I mean, we spend more than 10 hours in that office. You know, Do you understand? Fair. it's um, like having a stress reliever at work. And oh God. <laughs> I swear to God, see, eh, it's, that was why I was asking you if it was sweet, but again, you didn't want to share, but it was fun, trust me, it okay. was fun. So there are times when, you know, you are just like, you're yeah, just like there and they're just different this person just make dif makes different faces and you know <laughs> <laughs> oh 
Oh, fuck that. Okay. I, I did not see, see that. She was like, I'm going to get you later. Get I'm going to get you. Or oh, like the secret text And then you, 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 uh, you text, you send a the, video. I just, I just saw you like, pass. I like shaved your ass uh, because you're wearing. Or, or okay, yellow. while we're having a meeting and you're like, oh, I just felt like spanking your ass. Ah! Damn. <laughs> okay, that, that, that's hot. That's hot. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. So is it that... Thank God you are both guilty. So is it that you people neglect office rules that say no relationship allowed in this office? Neglect I and think you most... people want to just be spontaneous and enjoy your life. You most... forget the job that pays you. No. You forget the job that no, pays actually, you. No, actually, it happens after work. Yes, oh, most of what these the... wait, 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 activities wait, wait, wait. happen after work. What? Okay, wait. After so work. does that mean that within the work? time frame you guys never like did it's like quickies or no. it's just sex How, uh, you won't get they do I'm just, for your no office. i mean you never can tell like no, no. well it might not be in the office but maybe like lunch breaks you guys step out actually, to one place actually, it's actually. Not actually. <laughs> there so might have no, been no indecent no, activities no, that no, went actually, on no. during work hours but it never resulted in i mean Okay. The main thing, yeah, but it was like a build up to after work, yeah. Uh, actually, so after work, you satisfy all those cravings that yeah. you guys have. Well, have you ever yeah. had a crush before? The excitement, the, exactly. the intense yeah. feeling, yes, it feels so good. I swear, I shall go, I shall go, go, it's all right. Whoa. See, you Whoa. have forgotten heavenly race. <laughs> so, um, that means I'm um, spontaneous sex, a yes or you know. I don't do spontaneous sex. I don't do quickies. I like to take my time. Ah, why? <laughs> I mean, there's a lot of activities. I mean, I just like to... I like to see you beg. I like to see the ah. desire in your eyes. So, so I it just, turns you on when he begs. Exactly. Mm. Yeah. Turns me on when I see how much you need Probably. me. And I'm not about to do the old fast snacks shit. Like, bitch, like... Take your time take your with time. me. I'm what is. Don't worry. But I feel I feel like there's there's the time for take your time. And then there's a the time to be spontaneous. So it's like it might not basically be a quickie, or yes, it could be a quickie. No matter how spontaneous so, we are, so that, that means, that that means no your bit. checklist, your sex checklist does not include places like the cinema, um the car park, all of those things. No, we, it doesn't shall take our time wherever it is <laughs> so even up. if even if it's the cinema after the movie you know it's over and she's yeah, money, one of the people that's money. Money. cinema chair. no no wait <laughs> but hold on don't you think quickies are sweet like no 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 quickies are not sweet i have to take my time and get no, wet no, no i don't think that's true uh, no so the thing is uh, with people that you love you know you love this guy i feel like when you're in love Automatically, you're turned on by just looking at the person. For you people that like you, used to be you in get love. wet <laughs> just by looking at the person, and in that instance, even if it's a quickie, like there are times that it might just slam. It just slams. It just, mm-hmm. it just sparks. So, some of the most beautiful Actually. memories are from quickies. I've I never heard a quickie before. So she is for a no on spontaneous sex. No, no, no. It can be spontaneous sex, but okay, not spontaneous but you have to. quickie. <laughs> You Obviously. have to take your time with the drama you queen. Have to take you your see time. them, all of these hard girl, hard girl. No be drama queen where go date online, they talk. <laughs> this one, this one, look at her. Such a softy, such a lovey dovey girl. I beg, I beg. I like love. I also want you to be able to take your time with me. You have to be exactly. intentional. And sex is, when it comes to sex, like you said, the whole texting, the sexting, all the of those build things, up. the I talk, the build up, it makes it really beautiful. So like, exactly. so it's a whole process. And these days, do people, do guys even do this? Do they do this? Anyway? Yeah, we do. If not, you will not collect anything. We'll all uh-huh. go back home, honey. <laughs> if I do not, like, if I'm not satisfied, no, nobody will leave. Nobody will come out. If Konji go pee you as a person, that's <laughs> it. Konji, like, no, 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 no. See, like, like, you see the way people count body counts. If yeah. I don't come, I don't count you in my body counts. I'm not among we just had an entanglement we didn't know <laughs> talking about this the process is not talking complete. about this but honestly i feel like bad sex doesn't count it doesn't count. count it shouldn't count it shouldn't count you know 
You when guys. the sex is because the truth is you don't even remember it. Exactly. If, the sex, if the sex is bad, you don't even remember no, it. No, no, you no, don't it even, shouldn't be. It, it's not it's like it never happened. Exactly. You get my point. So now. if I'm counting like my body count and I'm like, oh, I only just have like two. My body question counts is because exactly. enter, I mean no enter. <laughs> it, bro, see, I if can't you remember. Have not come, I have no knowledge of if, it, so it did if, not. If you haven't <laughs> had if you haven't come while having sex, you are still a virgin. I'm telling you, you are a you are a, you are a bloody virgin. That's who you are. <laughs> is shocking though. exactly that's who you are you are a virgin <coughs> well if you ask your body comes, i agree zero. I zero. <laughs> zero. zero i mean i came the first time i had sex so i mean what's your excuse ooh, what's ooh, your ah, boyfriend's ooh, excuse ooh, ooh. Ah, ah. please don't pressure <laughs> that the violence boyfriend. for me anyway anywho anywho anyway so actually i asked her so we already know from your response that you are a spontaneous guy well. anywhere anytime any day so the thing is eh, spark things I, up. i'm very very cautious about three things i believe okay. time is Time is also like a currency. People are currencies as well. And then we have the actual currency. Do you understand? So okay. when you talk about time, mm-hmm. right? I I don't care however, whichever, you know, that spontaneity, that time, that moment, you know, just just move with the moment. That's yeah. all. All this uh, I need to take my time. That time may not come. <laughs> you may not come, sir. And, if that time comes. That's why it doesn't I'll make come. sense. To me. It doesn't make sense to me for all these people or all these guys where it's like, um, I don't have time, I'm so busy, so they're not there for you emotionally, yeah? Yeah. And they just want to I mean if you want to be my sneaky link, be my sneaky link. Do you understand? Let me know you're a sneaky link. But wanting to coming under the um tag of like you want a relationship or I'm into you and no, stuff no, no, and you no, do no, not no. have I really find it hard to believe guys that say I'm always busy. Like I try so hard, but at some point it never makes sense to me. And I believe that your intuition can never be one hundred percent wrong. In fact, I honestly think your intuition can never be wrong. Yeah. Okay. So when you feel this guy is just capping, he's most definitely just capping. Because I'm also busy. I work eight, eight to six. Apart from that, I have like side jobs, side gigs, other things I'm doing. So like seven days a week, 24 hours a day, I have something I'm doing. And I'm not even telling you to talk to me all the time, 24 hours in a day. But a little... A little text, a little here, there, but when you're totally unavailable and then you just come on and say, Oh, I'm sorry, I was busy, make it make sense. That way you will understand. In, in the try that you say, You are not on my list of priorities. I just want to knock you. I don't know why girls always make that mistake of now thinking, Oh, he loves me, but he's not, he doesn't love you. He might have some kind of some sort of feelings mm. towards you. Yeah, but, it's but he doesn't love, love you. It's not love. See, stop listening to what people say to you and listen to how they treat you. You would understand better. Mm. And if someone treats you like a, mm-hmm. a sneaky link, I think you should just go back. Stop trying to turn him to a boyfriend. He has said he's going to treat that he's gets, a whore. She gets. So why so, are you stressing? And it's funny because guys cannot take what they give back. At Jiba, they tell us. Mm-hmm. Guys can't take the energy they give back. No, 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 no. See, you see, from last year, I've learned to start giving guys back the energy. The they same do. energy. Nah, papa, because the whole you cannot break even, my again. You get, <laughs> so <laughs> if you're unavailable, they start asking questions like, "I, I was going who is on? The what, guy? Who is the guy? You know? But you have been unavailable all year round. And I never even any. asked you, do you have another girl? Oh, who is that girl? Oh, you're cheating on me. Blah, 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 blah. I didn't do that. But then the worst part of it is now when you cheat. The energy like, let's not even go into that conversation i think that's a conversation oh, have you ever cheated on someone before who mm-hmm. cool. <laughs> the question no, is no 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 maya this is, is you. you have you ever cheated on someone um, uh-huh. um <laughs> so honestly <laughs> all right no. she has done it you she, has done child. It, honestly, she has done it okay wait 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 honestly, let me honestly. let me let me state the situation here. <laughs> okay. so i don't think i would mm. say i've cheated on someone mm. before because i'm a very straightforward girl i like to be very straightforward so you if told I him like you're going you, to knock on another guy that kind of thing so if uh, i like you no honestly i'm very straightforward oh, so. you know, <laughs> <laughs> I, i'm not going to okay. judge you if you actually ah. cheat why, anyway why because <laughs> I like I actually remember at one point, yeah. <clears throat> I didn't know that I was someone was dating me without my consent, apparently. Ew, ew, uh-uh. ew. Okay. And then he didn't tell me we were dating. Uh-uh. But then I went to knock on another guy and then uh-uh. I think on my way back he started texting me. Okay, we did a video call and it was like my babe and I'm like, eh? Eh? Hey God, you were talking. You say you talked this thing like three hours ago. <laughs> we wouldn't be here right now. But then I don't think I felt guilty because I, I, I didn't know, you know. 
So back to the line of conversation, the office relationship, a yes or a no. But is it advisable though? I don't think it's advisable. Look, my advice is eh, have fun. Do you understand? Have fun. Life is for chopping chopics. This, the earlier, the, see, the earlier you know that this life, eh, we came here to do two things, okay. right? Okay. To live and to die. To live and to enjoy. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Death is constant anyway. Yeah. To live and to enjoy. Mm-hmm. So have fun. Office relationship, if it comes, I mean, just move it with comes. the flow. No, 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 no. Funny More... enough, office relationship is quite risky because it's very risky. I got paid with heads for a job of two hundred k. I went home and I was looking at myself and how disappointed my parents would be at me because I mean. I mean, I was so happy. I was so enthusiastic doing the work. Okay, so I do PR and content strategy. Okay. So I was just so happy doing the work. My rate card, that job was about 400k. Mm. He gave me 200, gave me heads. I came like twice and then uh-huh. he left me in the hotel room. And this was me. I, immediately after he left, I wrapped up his job, like did the, everything and then yeah. emailed it to him. Like, and then like two days later, I sat back thinking about my life. Like I just basically have- paid a guy. 200k to give me it i'm like <laughs> <laughs> like yo you just pay well, him to well, but i even, didn't i never thought that i'm cannot be that generous well, Guy. well you learnt on the job <laughs> nice one that's not a lie nice one that's you not a lie you learned on the job. <laughs> whoever okay i don't want to mention his name but you get luck it cannot happen again i don't do that anymore see yeah, i don't do that anymore for me, for me personally right yeah it will get to a stage where you just have to be like um emotionally mature when you are doing okay. office relationships yeah and it's, it's a decision yeah you know, just, it's, it's not going to be, is very important it's not going to be like it's not going to be like oh any girl you see on skate or any guy with muscles or stuff do you understand it has to be a decision you feel me so if you decide like oh my, i've been working you know, and there's no time to even mm-hmm. saturday sundays you know it is now. Just, so, yeah. so that one is you have to more if, spicy if you decide because, yes. right just have that conversation with the yeah. person but, well, but do people in the office have to know about it? it's just a sneaky that's link what I wanted situation to say. that's what i wanted to say okay so are you guys not even scared of i know people can be mature and the rest but the whole office gossip let me hey <clears throat> let's not even go into office you see once one particular gossip office starts go be, office. even the one that you do not do and the one, and the that, one that you, that you did everything is gonna pull see is, office, office gossips will come and, and it will go, go. just but like see, honestly, just like nothing, honestly, that's what i've just that's just what i've just come to peace with I've, i just know that people will talk about you yeah right. whether it's true or it's not true now and let me tell you something if two of my staffs are dating i find it very bothering because i mean we handle money there what if you guys now decide i want a better life for ourselves <laughs> let's carry my money around no you can't date in my office do you know something about emotions yeah, tell me they are hard to control you cannot control true. how you feel but you can control how you react to how you feel true. okay so now in this situation what if they can't control or most times it's, there's a very low pros- possibility and probability that these people know how to control yeah, their reactions yeah, to these emotions. Yeah. There will be sentiments. So now let's take it to the lowest level. Imagine a security and a cashier working together and then they now start winking at each other and stuff. You can't control. <laughs> if the security is supposed, if something happens and they're supposed to like tell the cashier to calm down so that the customer is in the right, trust me, you will not side with a stranger over your baby. Be like, yes, the cashier is right. So you join and beat the customer. That's how it works. So that's when maturity comes into play. Because exactly. wait, wait, wait. What's because the, the thing is, that I need mature. you to understand that. That's what I'm saying. So, mm-hmm. like, for instance, that's, me that's personally, I won't deal with someone that does not have sense. Okay. Personally. Because to <laughs> me, I feel like it's a dent on my reputation mm. as a person. Okay. Okay, okay let, let, let's look at it. But this wait, way. wait, wait. Let me land. So... Maturity comes into play because I know that, see, you have to treat me like a colleague where, while we're at work. We need to get the work done. We need to get the job but done. Emotions. So when you're coming, see, I, well, I'm speaking for myself. Me, okay. I know how to separate emotions from activities and what it that's is. That why you are that's blessed. Why it's, <laughs> that's why you are blessed. That's me. So for people that cannot do it, don't try it too. Exactly. You're going to exactly. lose your job. And this goes out to all yeah, employers out then. there. <laughs> Let me just tell you. You sure you heard what they both said. Let me just tell you the honest truth. Your employees do not care. They are gonna love themselves and knock themselves <laughs> oh in my your God. office. As we speak. In your oh office. Oh my God. See, as we speak, it's happening in your office. <laughs> okay. But do you know I've witnessed some people that actually 
they got married from dating in the office and nobody knew about it it was just that when they wanted to get married someone just had to quit the job and get another job somewhere yeah else. yeah yeah most so, times it happens and that whenever way. i see those guys i'm like i cause cap kifu now because you would not know you would not suspect a thing until you see the engagement details or the wedding card Again, i swear maturity. i've been shocked that's maturity I've been shocked. i mean that is the maturity i'm talking about like nobody had a hint it was just when um you know the cars were out and we're like wow these people were dating but like, if i was your employer out. i would stop trusting you because how did you hide that how I mean, didn't i suppose you have it? trust issues well, I do. <laughs> you, <laughs> do have trust issues. you do. <laughs> I mean, see, it's a bad thing to have trust issues because yeah, you know, yeah. But again, I mean, you can't trust have, anybody. It shouldn't be too True. much anyway. It should not be too. It should be open. If you know, waiting my ex do me, I almost enter cycle on top love matter. Me, I cannot do. I don't trust any you sons of Adams. I'm done with you guys. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Not hmm. with you guys. Let's even talk about the fact that I feel like women should do better. Okay. okay. So. <laughs> So we guys, but guys go all really out, nice. even though it's not intentional. But guys go for all out. For someone that paid 200k for heads, I mean, ah, sorry, penis is a lot. Sorry, <laughs> sorry, my parents will be disappointed in me if they know how much I've spent on <laughs> men. Yo, yo. So I feel like women should do more when it comes to Valentine gifts or general gifts and all. You see the guy on Valentine's Day or his or your birthday, he gets you a flower bouquet, he gets you this, he gets you that. You're like, oh my god. When it comes to valentine he's giving you a gift you're paying back with sex on his birthday he's probably still giving you a gift on his own birthday okay. and you're paying back with sex women no, can we do one question one question did he reject it it does not matter did he reject it is he matter. complaining it doesn't matter please get but your man the normal sneaklet and boxers you yeah. get it. It, i can fling so, in a wrapper I f- for me, Bro. I f- I for me, I feel like the kind of love I give is the kind of love I want to receive. So you don't want singlet and So boxers. no. <laughs> so when I'm giving you, I'm going all out and I'm doing this for you. That's because I also want that kind of energy. All right. Yeah. So even for men, men also want to feel loved. Come on. I know guys probably rate sex more than women do. Yeah. Honest yeah. truth. They rate yeah. sex. They've turned into a do. currency, so I mean. She'll yeah. get. We'll she'll give you get. a special one. Last longer for you. <laughs> yeah. I mean. See, but I'm not all in for that. Women, you yes. guys, you guys need to do better. I'm no, 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 no. But I like, I like, I think my love language, someone like me now, I don't have an issue because my love language is gift giving. Oh. I actually do love giving gifts a lot. Even my events, I use gifts she to invite gets... pizza and stuff. Whoa. So See, gift even giving when, is not my problem. Even when I'm just crushing on a guy, the kind of money I've spent on men. Guy. Yo. Funny enough, and it's always those trenches girls that no, no, why, why eat a lot that would come I, I, out I, I and be think, shouting. I don't think you feel bad, Maya. No, I don't. Oh, it's like, see, I mean, this is you, who I am. You know I can't take it out of myself. Well, I, it's who I am. But most class girls spend on men, but you will never hear it. You from never us. hear it. That's that's the only never. Truth. I don't think you, you feel except. No, I don't feel bad about it. I'm saying it as per, um, unlike what people expect out there yeah i i try to love the same way i want to be loved Loved. i'm not saying that regardless upon still any way you try to love me i would not accept it or something okay yeah so you need to understand your partner's love language yeah yeah mine is like quality time words of affirmation then gifts all right. Do you get me? So I want you to flatter me. I woo me. Why don't guys take time to woo ladies this day? I mean, they just want to bend you over. Like, why? What happened to... L- let me explain that. Ajibedi, please explain Let me explain that. See, see, All right. this, see this matter, eh? Now you cause problem for us sometimes. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Let me explain that. You okay. see, not all the time do we have that time to do all that. Because again, let, let, again, 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 here's the, here's the... For me, personally, my own experience is this. Okay. Eh? When you go to work, right... Hold on, now. This is rude. Listen, nah, excuse is the one give. Nah, because excuse. I don't know, uh, there's no when make I it say, make sense. When I, there's make no make sense. Right now. Me, you can literally leave me a oh my god. Before I left to work, to, before I left for work, you. Slept I was thinking about you. Or I was thinking about you. Oh, and or you know, a little you know, breakfast a little, note. Or, or you b- get me breakfast delivered to my office. Exactly. Oh, no, the romance shouldn't die. It shouldn't die. And like, that's the mistake men make. make when they have you, they start treating you anyhow. Is, is Forget really, you have still hot cake. I don't know why we can never <laughs> overemphasize the fact that it's the little it's the things little that things. count. So the the you buying me breakfast, I don't have to do this, I don't have to do that. It's 
you will chase me away. You will chase me. Okay, I don't care. Your let me finish. Yeah, finish. Romance should never die. Finish. Finish. Let, let never. me finish my explanation. Mm, finish. So, like, um, all the things you guys say, mm-hmm. I mean, I, I do it, but I just feel like it's just a normal thing. But when it comes to, like, um, expressing too much, you guys are talking about oh, to like okay. call yeah. you like no 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 you don't no no no, 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 no. relax you don't marry me now you don't knock me finish now it's I'm expecting too much <laughs> no that's not the case that's not the case so. <laughs> that's the, that's, that, the that's case. what Drama I'm understanding queen. from what Drama you're queen. saying make it make sense sir so <laughs> we're we're just saying what we're saying All right. is we're saying uh, 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 we don't uh, have uh, you to, we don't need you to call twenty four hours a day or this. It's just well, a little, little thing. thing. See, if you it's send me I understand that you're busy all day, so we cannot it's even talk things. because you're busy all day. But then when you send breakfast to my office, even if it's in the midnight that you're free and you see my message saying thank you. For that day, I'm settled. I'm fine. Trust I'm like, yeah, wow, nice. this is cool. Or even a simple message. Like, a simple message that just says, I'm going to be busy all day. So I know not to expect you to respond to my messages fast. Exactly. And if I call you that day, it's an emergency. Do you understand? So even if I called you that day, it's an emergency. Communication. I would, I would Communication. Not call you. <laughs> that is what it is. Ah, I well, you guys laugh it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's like we're about to finish <laughs> Ajibade as the only guy <laughs> I swear, <laughs> on this podcast. I swear. Anywho, anyway, <laughs> I think we've done a lot of justice to like the topic. So you guys do what it see the honest truth is, regardless upon still us saying um us saying office relationship, blah 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 blah. Just do whatever makes you happy. Yeah, thank you so much. So now we're going to be going into another segment where we do the drink, truth or drink, for my guests. So what's going to happen is I'm going to shuffle and I'm going to read whatever is on the card and you guys are going to answer. Or And if you don't answer, you're going to drink. Okay. I'll just be drinking. I have a question and I'm going to start with Drama Queen. Oh my God. Yeah, this question is for you. My Lord. Oh my God. Question for you says, how often are you intoxicated when you have sex? Are you often sober? What's the difference? I think um, I'm always almost high all the time. I so for I ladies, don't, I don't yeah, for ladies, I don't know if I'm different, but for ladies, I feel like when we drink alcohol, it goes down to your coochie. Not yeah, yeah, yeah. Much. Alcohol goes down there and it just makes you make crazy decisions. Everybody seems more attractive at that point. At that point. So, I mean. Honestly. So, oh, that's wow. for her. Mm-hmm. Ajibadi, this one is for, you. Uh-huh. Is, for me, is for you. Uh-huh. This is for you. If it's for me, give it to me. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Have you ever had to contact past partners for public health reasons? Like maybe you have got you had an STD before? Ask it get, straight up. Did get exactly. That's what I'm saying. Ask this question straight up. Is what is only card now? This one is so corny, corny. Okay, have you ever had an STD before and you no, had to I like haven't. call? I saw that. Would you believe him? Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Cool. Why do you believe me? Because <laughs> I've had. <laughs> 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 Jama Queen, this one is for you. Right. What scarred you the most about sex as you were coming of age? I think I looked forward to Nox. And I actually didn't oh, Nox really? till I was like 18, 19. I think I lost my virginity at 20. Oh, nice. So you're always looking forward to being. I was looking forward to it. I knew basically everything about sex. I just didn't want to have it yet because I didn't feel my body was ready. Oh. So yeah. wait, what scared you? Is it the fact that you had high expectations and the first time you tried it, it was just uh No, my sex life has always been good. I now speak the right guys. How do you know? E- hey. do I think we need tips. Maybe did, we're going wait, to have did, did we're going to have a subsection you? where you tell us like uh, <laughs> no, Maya, please do they submit their CVs? How would you know? You go know now hey. before you enter dirty water, you will know that this water is dirty. So when you see neat water, you know this water is neat. But for human beings, we are not like plants, we are extremely unpredictable. So Don't worry, there's this guy trending on Twitter that says his talent is he knows how to identify a loose shoe anyway. And also identify a decent guy anyway. Hmm. I basically have this worship fetish. I yeah. love being worshipped, especially in that in the bedroom. I love being oh, worshipped. Yeah. Yes, me too. Tell me my body looks <laughs> sexy. Bedroom, Tell Shambu. me my body is like a goddess. Mm. Tell me, treat me Tell like me, that. Treat me like that. Tell me, whisper things into my ear. And why stop don't, listening why to are what guys, people say. Why are guys to not? Why are guys not vocal while having sex? Same way you want to hear her mourn in your ears, or you want to feel what everything kind of you, want to, you want to hear. I want you to say, baby. What kind of I always fall. Yeah. I always 
catch Moonas. I always do. Yeah. I just Maya, what kind of vocals do you want to hear? I, you will, I want to hear I the... Want you to- um, yeah, 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 you get like that the, the yes oh, no, no. like damn Yo, my your body is divine oh, oh, it's yeah. like damn Go slow down. exactly yeah. um, give me directions tell me how you want to be treated oh, i want so. to slot you out personally i feel mm. like you should be vocal about mm. oh, how you want to be slotted out have you, have you ever like had guys that that are not yeah. vocal um have i I, I mean, think no, yes. Guys, only, I think only, I've had just one enjoy. experience. You, just, you know, go on to I've, no. Like you you they go on, you they crazy. Now, nah, mannequin, you <laughs> not. You take your time. We'll do it. We'll calm down. Instead of go on top. See, my people always <laughs> say, my people always say in Iboland, if you want to eat frog, eat the big one. So if they call you a real girl, you know that you eat that frog, I eat it to your satisfaction. Don't be having worker sex. Ah, mm. ah, Don't ah, do that. Ah, Talk. Say what you want. Problems. Per. Per. Oh, Are you ready to go? Yeah. So have you ever had like an inappropriate boner in public before? <laughs> I'm more <Yigba. laughs> <laughs> Bona. What's that? <laughs> there was a time like that I was Bonaventure. Oh my, my god. <laughs> and you know, for guys, because it's obvious, it is <laughs> obvious. For I mean, girls, for a girl, you could just cross your yeah, legs I mean, and that, then. That happened, that happened when I was like approaching puberty. Okay. Oh. So then it was in secondary school. Okay. I, oh. I think I was in GS3. So I didn't really understand that you, you have to wear tight boxers. It was always out there. And you, you know, you're talking your shirt now. It was always out there. And then the thing was like, XXL. Oh, sorry. Oh, he's trying to tell us one. the size. No, I said then. I don't know. I don't know now. How do you not know? I don't know. You guys, take it off your mind. So, yeah, of course, I have. Okay. Um, okay. <laughs> um, drama queen, I think we're going to wrap it off with this. I yeah. hope I don't have to drink. <laughs> What's the most surprising discovery you've made about your own body? Uh... I have the answer to that uh, question. Now. You will call me a gold digger if I say this. If you please me your very body. well with okay, my body. Okay, yeah, let me just body, put it this no, way. No, I want to hear this. If you please me very well, please uh, tell me. Uh, uh, I have okay. different I notice my body has different kinds of orgasm. Yeah. Okay. So there might be a time you treat me like really, really well. You do a random act of kindness. Yeah. You phone my account. Fuck that shit. Like my my coochie lit. Like I feel my clit tingling. I'm like the fuck, bro. Are you a whore? Yeah. Yeah. After I started asking, am I actually to stop your sexual or am I just a hoe? Because <laughs> <laughs> why the fuck are you wet? Because they gave you whoa, money. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, no, no. Why are you wet? Because they gave you money. I've asked myself yes, that question separately. And then I experienced like eargasm, like um. I have orgasms in my ear from good sounds. Oh, nice. Good sounds. Yes. Yeah, so, like, there's this wait, 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 wait. that goes actually, down my spine. Actually, that's why I say guys need to be vocal in the bedroom. Exactly. Because what when you mourn in my ear or you say something and you're like, good Damn, sounds. Like, your body is so divine. Like, my ass voice is good sound. Ah, yeah. oh, okay, I see. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Do, yeah, do yeah, I make you like, get wet? But, but, oh, wait. So bitch! Don't do that. <laughs> Maya, let on. me know. Let hold me know. On. Let me know. This thing she said now is—is is it true with you? Yes, I think it is because there's sometimes when the, when the you're just account, going. She, fund accounts, no, doesn't happen with me. No, no, no. Fund your account doesn't happen with me. But the me. eargasm happens with me. Yeah. So it's like I need you to say things to me. I need oh, you to be in the mood, and you're oh, telling tell me, me stories. Oh, yeah. I, I think you go I, like. I, I think it's true. Like out of ten women, seven. Would do you guess because at that point I don't know there's just this spark that just makes your body open up. I might be wild with you depending on cool. what you whisper to me when we're now like there's the time we'll be on missionary whisper crazy shit in my ear. Yeah. I'm gonna push it and we're going doggy because I want you to slam me out. Okay. 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 Yes. okay. Danger. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't a danger. Yeah, oh, see, it's very funny. So the next episode that we're going to have out sometime soon. I think I'm going to take a different route because these guys are too honest. Like, I was expecting someone to say, mm, I'm going to drink. Oh, mm, okay. Nah. But, mm, but anyway, we're in the business of sex intense. Mm-hmm. Right. Yeah. Oh. So, yes, it has to be. If it's not intense, <laughs> then why? Why Why are you on the show if it's not intense? Thank you so much for coming, to for watching the show this far, for being, you know, here with yeah, us. Thank you for having I me. Have, I have thank Drama you. Queen with me, and I have Ajiba Day with me, and then I remain your host, Myers. Oh. Fire, oh. Fire. Oh. Yes. <laughs> She's a fire. Why am I getting excited? <laughs>